Welcome to Unity with Pam, with your host, Pam Willis Hovey. This is about Unity with Pam, Broadcast Team Kids. This is your day. This is not my day. This is your day. This is your day to shine. You work so hard for it, and you deserve everything that you get. Let's give you a round of applause. This year, I'm going to be doing much little in my own show, in my own program. Again, it's about the kids, so I'm excited. This is the first year I have had kids to co-host my show, and we are going to be broadcasting it on TV. So in a couple of weeks, you'll get a chance to click on WYBU every Monday night at 7 o'clock, and you will see the kids in charge of this. I'm going to turn this into my wonderful co-host hands. Ms. Jamia Foster and Ty Ray Anderson, please come forward. Introducing the Unity with Pam, class of 2014 and 15. Please stand and welcome the Unity with Pam, class of 2016. will be given by Azazel Dunlap. Dear Lord, thank you. Please bless us for all that you've done. Please bless my family and everybody else's family because we all love you. Please protect us and please make sure we don't mess up. Please. Thank you. Our music selection will be done by Team Caitlin.
welcome you, Vincent Jones II. Good afternoon. I'm Vincent B. Jones II, and I'm a sixth grader at East Columbus Magnet Academy. Just last year, I stood as a graduate from this, for the same program. It is a distinct honor to welcome you to the Unity with Pam broadcasting team commencement ceremony for the class of 2016. To our esteemed guests, family, and friends, we extend our hands for fellowship and say welcome. The gradu graduating class has invested many hours in learning the multifaceted world of broadcasting. Under the, under the, the direction of the Unity with Pan Broadcasting Team and the partnership with Wesley Heights Elementary School, the class has become an, an emerging leaders in our community. Please settle in and take note of these scholars. We are growing, we are learning, but now we pause to celebrate. Greetings to all. Unity with Pam is being brought to you by these great sponsors. Shoulda, woulda, coulda, a new book by author Pam Willis Hovey is now available. This story of a young Joanna and her journey of love will have you excited with the turn of every page. Shoulda, woulda, coulda is available for purchase through Amazon and at unitywithpam.org. It has been said, all that is necessary for the triumph of evil is for good men to do nothing. How long will we let this continue? Do something. Please help. Call us to get involved. I'm a fan of this plateau. I'm a fan of things that go. I'm a fan of all things kitschy. I'm a fan of Lionel Richie. Hello. I'm a fan of DQ. I'm a fan of DQ Bakes. Bakes. DQ Bakes. I'm a fan of warm chibata. I'm a fan of cold and hot. Melty snacks on my snack break. I'm a fan of DQ Bakes. New artisan style sandwiches, snack belts, and desserts. Hot out of the oven and only at your DQ. This is fan food, not fast food. I'm a fan! When your child is sick, you take them to the doctor, right? Well, at Zoe Pediatrics, we don't just take care of sick kids. We want to keep the healthy ones healthy. At Zoe Pediatrics, we're in the business of prevention. We would love if when our children are 100 years old, they could say they were never sick a day in their life because of what they learned at Zoe Pediatrics. Don't wait for sickness. Children don't have to be sick to get better. Good doctors treat illness. Really great doctors prevent disease. Zoe Pediatrics, 10th Avenue at 17th Street. Uh, you do know the experts at Midas will tell you what needs fixing now and what can wait, right? Like, I don't know, brakes? <laughs> of course I do. Trust the Midas Touch for brakes, tires, oil, everything. Come into Chester's Barbecue for our world-famous mouth-watering ribs. Smoked fresh on our grill daily. Or try one of our barbecue pork plates with fresh sides. Chester's has delicious sandwich combos to choose from that are sure to please. We also serve tempting home-cooked favorites. And don't forget to take home your own bottle of great sauce. Chester's Barbecue, serving the best food at the best price. With three locations to serve you. Welcome to Unity with Pam, with your host, Pam willis Hovey. Hello, I'm Azazel Dunlap, and this is how broadcast has influenced my life. Broadcast has influenced my life positively. The teachers were respectful. They squeezed fun into it respectfully. They also taught me stuff I didn't even know, like about cameras, air views, and electronics. I'd like to thank Miss Pam, Mr. Greg, and where Mr. Red is. I'd like to thank all y'all. Thank you. Hello, my name is Brooklyn Jones, and this is how the broadcast has changed my life. The broadcast team has changed my, me because I wasn't always good at talking to people I didn't know 
and I wasn't good at interviewing people I didn't know until I went to the broadcast team program. They helped me learn how to communicate with someone and they helped me interview interview they helped me learn how to interview interviewees that I didn't know. So if you go to Wesley Heights and you're thinking about going to a program, this is the program for you. I've met so many talented and nice people, so this has changed me. I would like to thank Miss Pam, Mr. Red, Mr. Greg, and Miss Elworth and the rest of the UNT with Pam staff. Hello, I'm Damian Kopp, and this is how broadcasting has changed my life. Broadcasting changed my life a lot. Broadcasting has made me feel like I've accomplished something great. It has made me see the world a different way. It has shown me that I have the potential to do something great. Broadcasting has influenced me to do something and make a change. My name is Jemiah Brinkley, and this is how broadcast has changed my life. Broadcast has changed me to not be shy and how Miss Pam has put in work to do nice things for us and also Miss Edwards. Also, it taught me how to work a camera. Thank you for all the staff and broadcast. Hello, my name is Jayla Powell, and this is how the broadcast team changed my life. The broadcast team made me talk more. It also helped me open up about my life to other people. I used to not know a lot about television facts and technology. This program has inspired me to try new things and make my dreams come true. I want you to stay right here. Sometimes you have surprises and you don't tell everybody what's on your mind. So I apologize for not doing that. This is my director, Ms. Delisa Wilson. And I'm, a, I'm like my father, we're just off the cuff and people who pay attention to details, we'll run you crazy. <laughs> But um, I want to ask you something, and I want this to totally be your decision. Now, your parents and your family know, but I would like for you to be my boss woman. I would love for you to shadow me. I like, I like you. I like the fact that you are compassionate. I like the fact that you take charge. I like the fact that you care about your teammates, to the fact that you even care about your little cousin to make sure she has her questions. You would make a good leader, and I would like for you to be our team captain. Would you accept my offer to be my boss woman of 2016-2017? You do? I'd love to have you. And I have a good friend of mine, District Attorney Julia Slater. We have a pink lapel pin, and pink means compassion. It means female. It means young intonance, young innocence. And this is all this young lady is. So I have a good friend that is going to pin you. And as you wear this pin, 20 years from now, remember that you was always this day and this day forward will continue to be a boss woman. District Attorney Julia Slater. Would you like to say something? Okay. Thank you so much. I have another good friend that is with me, and I, I appreciate him. You know, him and his family do a lot in this community. You know them, Pizzo Management. Um, McDonald's has kept me looking like a good, healthy woman. So I have a surprise for Mr. Tadre Gordon, who knew nothing about what's going on, but see, his mama did. So I'm going to uh, bring my good friend up, Mr. John Pizzo, accompanying with Mr. Vincent B. Jones II. And I'm going to, and Tadre, please come forward, Tadre Gordon. I did not know that I was going to have a big speaking part in this, so I'm going to try to make it brief. Um, I know I gave this speech a little bit last year, but um, my, my first um, encounter with this wonderful, wonderful program 
was when all these fantastic young people came to the Capitol uh, in February of 2015. And most of the time when you see young people in a setting like that, um, they get real timid and they don't talk very much. But Tadre Gordon sees me walk into the Capitol Rotunda, stands up and marches straight across the floor to me, hands, puts his hand out and says, Mr. Pizold, my name's Tadre and I'm going to interview today. What can I call you today? You can call me and ask for a job because I want to hire you. So long story short, shortly after this, uh, this program last year, I brought my dad with me, and my dad looked at me. He said, you need to snatch that kid up before somebody else does. So I put Tadre to work in one of our restaurants, working with our customers and making them feel good, making them feel special, just like he makes me feel special, and I'm sure so many of you all feel special. So Tadre is a... a a lucky, lucky young man to have two parents that really love him, and we're all lucky to have him in our lives. So it is my honor to, pre uh, to present this certificate of graduation, and it says, Where Wherefore, by diligent effort and determination, it is hereby recognized that Tadre Gordon, 2016, former Boss Man of the Year, has successfully completed participation in the Unity with Pam broadcasting team. May 14th, 2016. Congratulations. Proud of you. And that is yours. It kind of fell out. Would you like to say anything? I know you want to say something. Come on now. Um, well, at first it was hard because when I first got into broadcast team, I'm just going to be honest with you, I had no clue what I was doing. And it was hard to get used to the concept and hard to hard to get used to my peers and my surroundings. But as soon as I got used to it, I knew what I was doing and I knew that I could do what the higher grade levels in the broadcast team could do. I knew that if I, if I was chosen to be on this team, I must have to do something. So I did something that I needed to do. I completed my task and got what I needed done. And I couldn't have done it without any of my peers in the broadcast team, Miss Pam, Mr. Greg, Mr. Red, and especially Vincent Jones. So I'd like to thank all those people who actually were there for me when I needed it the most. I have a surprise for you. I have a special guest. You see her on the news. Her name is Leah Uku. She's on WLTZ News 38. Come to the stage. Your parents knew about this, but you knew nothing about this. You, you well, first of all, nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, well first, I'll set that down. Hi, everyone. Um, it's been kind of quiet, so I just wanted to make sure everybody is, is, is awake and engaged. Can I get a big hello when I say hello? Okay. okay. Uh, my name is Leah uh, Uko. I am the evening anchor and reporter at WLTZ. I'm new here, and whenever I get an email about something involving the community and kids, and especially the words broadcast, my eyes just zoom into it. And when Pam uh, sent out an email to our whole station, uh, I saw it. It wasn't directed toward me. It was directed toward anybody who saw it, and um, I said, that I wanted to get involved with this for the next school year for obvious reasons. It's broadcast and it's kids who are interested um, in it. Our industry these days is kind of uh, shifting a lot, of, uh, a lot. We're not getting as many quality people as we used to get. And I think it's because we don't reach out to kids when they're young, if they have um, a passion for being on camera or behind. Um, so that was why I wanted to be here today. Um, Azazel. You already spoke today, um, so I don't, I'm don't. i not sure why you're getting this award, but I'm pretty sure Pam thought you were the boss man, that you had a certain quality that was a leadership quality, um, that all your peers, are you agree? You're like, yeah, that, that is right. <laughs> That's good. Well, um, I just want to say congratulations, and if you do continue to stay in this industry or work with cameras, like you said, um, just be sure to be confident and have thick skin the older you get. Um, if you get into this industry, you'll have a lot of mean people, 
but just don't take it personal because people are mean and people are nice as well. And uh, just make sure you stand tall and confident in your strengths. And always remember this award. How old are you? So you're 11 years old. So you remember this when you're in your 20s and you're going into whatever field, especially broadcast, if you ever doubt yourself, you remember Miss Pam believed in you and you believed in yourself. And that should always bring you back to standing confident and believing in your skills. Yeah? Okay, well, congratulations. I'm gonna shake your hand again. And we're gonna present you, are you presenting or, okay. She has voted you, nominated and chosen you as the boss man of the year. So this is your award. I don't know where the photographer, okay, he's gonna want you to take a picture with that, and congratulations. Unity with Pam is being brought to you by these great sponsors. For over 25 years, the Bug Patrol at All Star Pest Control has protected thousands of families' homes from pests and rodents. Although most treatments have no odor and are environmentally friendly, our high technology products and methods get absolute results. And we guarantee it! All Star Pest Control, over 25 years of guaranteed protection. Come into Chester's Barbecue for our world famous mouth watering ribs, smoked fresh on our grill daily. Or try one of our barbecue pork plates with fresh sides. Chester's has delicious sandwich combos to choose from that are sure to please. We also serve tempting home-cooked favorites. And don't forget to take home your own bottle of great sauce. Chester's Barbecue, serving the best food at the best price. With three locations to serve you. Hello, I'm Pastor Willis. And I'm Co-Pastor Emma Willis. And we welcome you to be a part of our ministry. We have a wonderful illustrated teaching and preaching we want to share with you. And, and also we share with you our dance ministry and also our choir and our outreach ministry. And we have a wonderful Sunday school. And we welcome you to come and be a part of this ministry. God bless you. The average home has more than five devices connected to the internet. Is your internet strong enough to keep up? At WOW, we can boost your internet with speeds up to 110 megabits per second. Booyah! So you can handle it all and then some. That's WOW, not what you'd expect from a cable company. Find your perfect speed at wowway.com. Welcome to Unity with Pam, with your host, Pam willis Hovey. Now I'm going to turn the graduation awards into the hands of the director for this part, Mr. Lisa Wilson. Now at this time, would the class of 2014 and 15 please come forward? At this time, would the graduating class of 2016 please come forward and stand right in front of someone on the stage, in front of you? Right here. At this time, medals will be presented to the fourth graders. They will be presented with an achievement medal. Raise your hand if you're a fourth grader. Please present the medals. At this time, the fifth graders will be presented with a community service medal. Raise your hand if you're a fifth grader. Alicia Powell.
Jayla Powell. Hakeem Oliver. Jemiah Brinkley. Brooklyn Jones. Damian Cobb. And last but not least, Azazel Dunlap. Thank you for watching Unity with Pam. If you would like to be a sponsor, please contact us or visit unitywithpam.org. Come on in to Sugars for a sweet taste of Southern cooking. You will be taken back to Sunday dinner at Grandma's house with everybody. Daily special serving fried chicken, collards, black eyed peas, also melt in your mouth cornbread. You will want to ask for seconds. Also try one of our homemade desserts. You will be in sweet, sweet heaven. Sugars offers catering for all your corporate church and family gatherings. They would do all the work and save you all. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. A new book by author Pam Willis Hovey is now available. This story of a young Joanna and her journey of love will have you excited with the turn of every page. Shoulda, woulda, coulda is available for purchase through Amazon and at unitywithpam.org. It has been said, all that is necessary for the triumph of evil is for good men to do nothing. How long will we let this continue? Do something. Please help. Call us to get involved.